Welcome back to the only game where your grandmom kicks you out of your house for not having a job, and then the job you decide to get is delivering jelly to your neighbor. What is going on, TFG squad? My name is Brandon, and welcome back to Wobbly Life. So I played this last week. I love the game. You guys really seem to love the game too, so let's jump right back in. Okay, I think, yeah, <laughs> each level starts with me being kicked out of my grandmom's house. I can actually see her in the window. Nope. Hey, Graham Graham. Oh, don't you walk away from me, Graham Graham. I got a job delivering jelly last episode, and now I have like $80 in my pocket. So I don't know why you're still kicking me out of your house. I think I left 40 bucks in there. She better not have spent it. Hey. Hey, Graham Graham. Where's my $40 that I left in here? You better not have spent it on more of your white wigs. I know that's not your real hair. Don't you look away from me. You know what? My Graham Graham is a real piece of work. You guys also told me last time that I'm basically naked. So <laughs> there's ways that I can get different clothes and different skins in this game. I just don't know how to do that yet. Let me know in the comments. I'm going to try to figure it out today. Also, everybody told me, Brandon, go to the city and go to the nuclear power plant because there's a really cool level there or, real, or a really cool job. I don't know, but I'm gonna go there. So I'm currently taking the only mode of transportation that you can take in Wobbly Land, the bouncy ball thing. I don't know exactly what to call it, but this seems to be the fastest way to get around town. If there's a quicker way, definitely let me know. If you guys want to see more Wobbly Land or Wobbly Life on the channel, don't forget to smack that like button and don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new. Okay, so it looks like the drawbridge is currently up. I don't know if there's like a big boat coming through, but I should be able to bounce my way through. Come on, man. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. Get ready. Go. Ooh. Oh, that was actually... A I think it's dropping. Okay, there really wasn't a very big gap there. Okay, so you guys told me to go to the nuclear power plant, which I can see right in front of me. Hey, get away from me, taxi. Get away from me, you darn taxi. Okay, I'm gonna go over there. If there are other cool jobs that you guys want me to play, definitely let me know. I know I'm asking for so much in the comment section, but I'm excited. I think this is a really fun game, and there's so much more I want to do in it. Okay, this power plant was a lot farther away than I thought it was gonna be. I guess you wouldn't want to live right next to a power plant, so that makes sense. I finally got there, but there's like a fence around. Oh, okay. <laughs> There's not really great security. I just kind of pushed my way through the fence. I, I guess it's a not very secure nuclear power plant. That's okay. Okay, let me go over to the logo. There's got to be a way to get inside. I know you guys told me there's a really good job here. Could this be it? Let me get off of my bouncy castle thing. Uh, hello, hello sir. Hi there. Uh, do you have a job for me? No? Okay, what did he say? Is this... This is one really... I didn't hear what he said. You know, shut up, man. I'm not in the mood. Okay, can I get in here? Press the red button. I struggled with that last time. Oh, that wasn't that bad. Oh! Oh, this looks really cool in here. Hello! Uh, I'm gonna name you John R Robinson. Yep, this guy's name is John Robinson. What did he say? I'm not reading. Uh, we keep lights all over Wobbly Island. Uh, F to interact. Okay, here we go. The waste removal job. I need to catch barrels. I need to load them onto the truck. And then I need to drive and dispose in the quarry. This seems way too complex for me. If you guys remember last episode, I struggled making burgers, let alone working in a nuclear power plant. Also, what is that suspicious spill over there? I, I, if I get some sort of a disease from working this job, I will sue John Robinson. Okay, fine, I'll accept the job. Oh no, I'm on a timer again. I don't like being on timers. Okay, so I have four minutes and 24 more seconds. Let me grab this, grab it. Oh my goodness, did I name myself? I don't know if I ever named myself. Okay, so I need to pack them onto the truck. Is it... Wait, what's the... Is it this truck? I, am I supposed to put them on this truck? What? Oh, there are things exploding. Okay, let me... Oh, I'm turning green. Oh, no. Okay, um, this is not going well. This is actually... Oh, that was another explosion. Okay, let me grab this one. Am I... What truck am I in? You know what? I'm going to try to follow the arrow... Or is that what I do after I loaded it onto the truck? I'm clearly not very good at this. I am clearly very bad at this. I, I'm going to blow up all of Wobbly Land, and it's going to be completely my fault. This is bad. Many months later. Huh. There we go. I got it on the back of the truck. Okay, I got one out of five. Here we go. Let's get another one. They don't blow up once they're in the truck, right? If they do, that would be a load of barnacles. Brandon, you missed. Ah! That didn't scare me. I just felt like screaming to test out my vocal cords. Believe me. 
I wasn't scared at all. Okay, let's do that. I only have two minutes and 49 seconds. Come on. There we go. Okay. So, um, I, I, I wasn't bad at basketball back when I was a kid, so I hope I can shoot basketballs better than I've been shooting. Here we go. Ready? Hiya! Okay. It seems like once they're in the back of the truck, they don't explode, which is kind of good, kind of a miracle. Huh! Okay. We got four out of five. We got four out of five. Here we go. I'm green. I would like to turn yellow before I pick up more of the waste. There we go. Okay, that was actually good timing. And hi -ya! There we go. I'm getting good at this, boys. I'm getting good at this. So I have five barrels in the back of the truck. I don't really want to run into things. Oh! Right as I say that. Right as I say that. Okay, I have two minutes and seven seconds to get to the... What was it? The quarry? Yeah, I think I'm trying to get to the quarry. I have no idea how to get to the quarry. I'm going to try to just follow that arrow and hope that that's the quarry. I still have a decent amount of time. I feel like I'm doing well so far. Should I just go straight down? No, because I don't want these things to explode. If they pop out the back of the truck, they're going to explode. I think I want to go... Oh, jeez. I am not driving very carefully considering, you know, I'm carrying nuclear waste in the back of my truck. Wait, how do I get down there? Oh, maybe I have to go all the way around. Son of a nutcracker. I got a minute and 25 and I haven't gone anywhere. Do I just have to, like, go down a mountain? Oh, jeez, there is a city bus that I almost exploded. I I almost just caused, like, a nuclear fallout. Okay, here we go. Here we go, Brandon. Um, I... Oh, it's right here. How did I miss that? I'm so dumb sometimes, guys. I have 23 seconds. There's no way I make it now. Okay, if I don't complete this mission, I'm gonna go back and try to beat it again. I don't think this is gonna happen. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. Oh, I lost a couple barrels. I lost a couple barrels. Okay, I'm just throwing them in here. Does that count? I got them in the quarry. I, I disposed of them in the quarry. I, I don't think that worked. Nope. Definitely didn't work. And I crashed the truck in the process. That was just a disaster, guys. Okay, I'm driving back to the nuclear power plant again, not using any of the roads because roads are for people that, uh, you know, abide by the law. And clearly I don't abide by the law. Oh my goodness gracious. I got the truck stuck. Okay, it is nighttime and that is... uh. One heck of a moon. I don't know what planet we're on. Well, I guess it's Wobbly Land, but that is an ugly moon. No offense, moon. Okay, let me go back in the power plant. Can I do the job again? Okay, I'm back inside. Oh, they actually replaced the truck with another truck. Okay, well, that's actually kind of nice. Apparently, they didn't have very much faith in me if they bought a new truck. Okay, e to F to interact. I will accept the job. I think it's kind of funny they'll give me the job again, considering I, like, blew up their entire power plant last time. But, hey, I won't complain about that. Let's grab one. And we... Now we're experts. hi -ya! Oh, jeez. Never mind. Apparently, we're not experts enough. Huh! There we go. Okay. One for one so far. Wow. Okay, I can really jump. And... Ha! Huh! Beautiful. Two for two. Here we go. Whoa. Oh, I don't want these to explode. I don't want these to explode. Ha! Huh! There we go, Brandon. There we go. Let's grab this one. This will be four. Ha! Beautiful. And one more. One more barrel of toxic waste that I'm going to be delivering in the quarry that definitely doesn't want toxic waste, but that's okay. Okay. Here we go. I'm in way earlier than I was last time. Let's see if I can make it to the quarry without, you know, blowing things up. Darn it. I parked my truck in the way. Let me get out and move the other truck. <laughs> I am such a nuisance even to myself. Let's move this darn truck out of the way. Oh my goodness, Brandon, you've got to be kidding me. Let's get this out of the way. Okay, beautiful. Now let's hop out of the truck. Let's go in the right truck. I hear things exploding. Okay, I may be carrying five gallons of toxic waste, but I'm still not going to use the road because, you know, the road takes way longer than just going right through wobbly land. I think the turn is soon. Where's that darn quarry? I think it's right before the bridge, isn't it? There it is. There it is. Okay. Oh. Okay, this is when I want to start driving a little bit more careful. Don't spill the barrels, Brandon. They are moving all over the back of the truck. I still have two minutes and 40 seconds. Okay, I'm making my way down the quarry hill ever so, so, ever so carefully. Ever so carefully. I'm at about two minutes and eight seconds to go. I can definitely do this. I'm pretty sure I just have to put it on that one conveyor belt. But I'm not sure. If I'm doing that wrong, definitely let me know. Okay, yep, the arrow is pointing right here. That's got to be it. Okay, let's park right here. Let's get out of the truck, and I got to grab one at a time. One at a time, Brandon. Oh, jeez. Okay, let's grab one. Wait. Why do I... Oh, no, I got five. I got five. Okay, let's do this. Let's put it right here. Let's do that. Is that one? Did I... Did I do it? I'm feeding the monster. 
Oh, I got one. Okay, good, good. I got a minute and 37 seconds. That, I didn't notice the monster when I came here. Oh my, Brandon, stop getting stuck. Oh, this is so embarrassing if I don't finish it now. If I don't finish it now, this will be so, no, I don't want to grab two at a time. I don't want to grab two at a time. Come on, Brandon. Let's go. Feed this scary looking monster that looks like he wants to eat your face off. Yep, that's what we're dealing with right here. Okay, here we go. This is going to be barrel number three. What is this guy eating? Like, what kind of a monster eats nuclear waste? I mean, you know, if I was a monster, I'd, you know, I'd like pizza. Let me know in the comments if you guys were a monster, what would you want to eat? I definitely wouldn't choose nuclear waste, but hey, you know what? Whatever suits his monster self. I got one left after this one. I think I'm actually doing pretty good. Oh, I, I better get paid well for this, man. I mean, I am handling nuclear waste right now. They better not give me like $30 or $40. Oh, if you get stuck now, Brandon. Oh, if you get stuck now, Brandon. Okay, there we go. There we go. Come on. 35 seconds. Come on. What do I get? What? $50? I literally just handled nuclear waste in a city with millions of people. And you gave me a bag of $50. What a load of barnacles this is. So I loaded the $50 on the back of the truck and I'm on my way to the bank to cash it out. I can't believe I did all that work and you gave me 50 bucks. Oh, it looks like there was like a car accident over here and believe it or not, it actually wasn't my fault. At least I don't think it was my fault. I probably, I probably caused that car accident somehow or another, but I don't really know how. Wait, there's an ATM over here. I wonder if I can deposit the money here. Let me try. Please take my money. $50. Yes. Okay. So the dollar signs probably represent where there's an ATM. That's actually pretty good. Okay. So I now have $185. Can I go bowling or can I get a job working at the bowling alley? Come on. Hey, hey, stop ignoring me. I would like to bowl. Excuse me. Fine. You know what? I'm just not going to pay. I'm just going to bowl on my own here. Okay. Here we go, Brandon. Oh, I can cheat by using one of these things. Although, I, I, it's not really cheating if I don't know how to use it. You know what? Forget it. I'm just going to bowl on my own. Here we go. Ah! Nope. Okay, that wasn't the greatest ever, but that's okay. You know what they say. You get two rolls per bowl. I don't think anyone ever says that. Okay, here we go. Uh, here we go. And... Ah! Oh, that could be good. Yeah! I got a strike. Put your hands in the air. Clap for me. That was amazing. Okay, I'm getting out of this bowling alley. So I'm heading over to this car accident, and I think I know just the thing to do to help these people out because they seem like they're going through a rough time. Hey, lady, get out of your car. I'm about to steal it. Get out of your car. Yep. I'm just, I'm just stealing this poor person's car. I kicked them out. Oh, man. I'm such a terrible person in this game. Whoa, look at this house. Oh, I want to buy this one day. How much is this? It's probably more than the $150 that I have. This house is $1,300. You know what? In real life, if a house like this was $1,300, I would buy it in a heartbeat. Okay, here we go. Let's try to find one more job. Oh no, there's a hospital. There's no way I should be working at a hospital. Hello there. <laughs> Take the ambulance out, find a patient, load the patient, transport the patient to the hospital. You know what? I'm actually going to decline the job for now. I want to come back and do that afterwards. I think I see the place where I can get clothes. Streetwear urban style. This has got to be where I can get clothes because you know what? Eventually, I'm going to get arrested for running around naked. I mean, this is getting very inappropriate. I would like to buy one shirt and one pants, please. How do I, how do I buy it? Use the changing rooms. Oh. Okay, thank you, sir. Are you calling me ugly? F to interact. Uh, oh, okay. A hundred dollars for a pirate hat? Are you out of your mind? Okay, I'm just gonna buy whatever the cheapest shirt possible is. It's a gray shirt with a pink slime on it. Well, it's $50, so yes, please. Are there any... Oh, I can buy pants, so I won't be completely naked now. <laughs> Look at this. I literally have like leaves for pants. That's how poor I am. Okay, so I have the gray shirt with the pink ugly man and the leaves and I think it's a hundred dollars. Yeah, okay. That's actually not that bad. Whoa, they actually have a movie theater here. All right, what's playing? We've got the Wibbly Wobblies, the Taxi Driver, the Wobbly Life and Meet the Wobblies. 
Okay, those sound like the worst movies I've ever seen. Guys, I'm actually going to end the video there. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Definitely check out my brand new vlog channel. It's called TFG Vlogs. I have a new video over there all the time. I think you guys will love it. Go over there and subscribe and say hi to me in the comments. And I will see all of you in the next video. One ticket for the wibbly wobblies, please.